Dang, they just put me right back into it. All right. Uh. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Nigga, if you can't get it to work, what, if she can't get it to work, what make you think you gonna be able to get it to work? Hmm, nothing. You don't tell me that it ain't no batteries. There's no batteries in, here. in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. So what? I gotta look for some batteries now. All right. Well, the Clementine doing. She did almost got eight. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. Say less. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a... So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good, despite the circumstances. Yep. We'll sit tight. Okay. I thought it was a get to know each other question that didn't get to know nobody. Oh, there go a battery right there. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Getting crazy. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hun. Just finding batteries. All right. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Boy, shut your stupid. It must be his folks. Oh yeah, he did say his people was in Macon. And we in Macon? I think we in Macon, I don't know. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh... Let's not do that. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. We get the batteries to this girl. This battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Nothing. Bro, I just gave her batteries. I know she did not put a man on. Ah, wait. Did I put a man on? I put a mirror on. I look. There we go. That's how you put a mirror.
Yes, sir. The you fixed there it. There we go. Continues to spread unchecked. The estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals. Looks like nobody got a chance to exposed. donate anything. The station is okay. In the event of a full. Uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Oh, here we go. Thank you. Of course. God bless you all. Dang. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. I don't care. Like what? Like you guys are supposed to care. Like he came at me and the kids, bro. He was coming at the kids crazy, bro. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. Look at I've him. seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't oh, get he over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. I don't even want to talk to her no more, bro. To be honest with you. She got too much of an attitude. We just... Hey, Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. <laughs> anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? Well, her family's dead, so... That's awful, Lee. Yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. Damn. She's just a little girl, Ken. Lee says she spent days on her own. That takes toughness. But you have no idea what sort of emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. That boy Doug, boy. What's the plan? Traumatizing. tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They own this place. Uh... I don't know. Well, wouldn't they be at their house or somewhere like that? Cat, it's not our business. Not sure they made it. We passed some houses on the way in, and things are pretty bad here. Well, you just don't know. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves over We it. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happen. We didn't make a choice that killed John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Word, though. Try to let it go. Why got you looking like that? Try to get some rest. It's not much, but here, for the boy. Oh, thanks, Lee. He appreciates it. That's Only the sweet, kids, Lee. bro. Only the kids, bro. Uh, I think I've seen a door I can walk through. I don't know where that mug is, though. Oh, there it go.
Dang. Well, what is Clementine doing behind me? I can't. I can't think about them in here. This door leads to the back alley. Dang, they died. The pants came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Hey, gentlemen, my folks, bruh. He messed up his life too before all this. That's the crazy thing. Find anything? Where did she come from? Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Okay. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. Oh. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Oh? Thanks. Don't worry about it. Oh, why she? Nah, stop playing, fool. Ain't no way she just gave him the look. What's that? This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. Damn. And his canes protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you and your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not gonna go looking for him. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Mm. Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. Nobody does, I don't think. I bet my dad does. Doggy dog world. Okay, here we go. Mm. 
Do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it either. Word. All right, a little Forget further. soccer. Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I wouldn't blame them. Why? Did you fight? I fight with my mom sometimes. We didn't fight. We just didn't talk for a while. Look, my family's gone and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Why she look over like that? Ow! Why she finna snitch? Oh. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find your bandage. It is a med kit right there. I said a med kit. I put too much for it. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Uh, Let's see if we can do something about it. That could look deep. Does it hurt when I do this? A little, not too much. You sure? Yeah. That boy Lee, like, basically raising another, like, raising somebody else's kid. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. In a zombie apocalypse, though, like, he doing it in Lee? a zombie apocalypse. Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Oh snap. I know it's a box TV. It gotta be. <laughs> That's what I figured. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Is there anything else in here that I need to get? Nah. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? I just told you, what do you mean? No, he wasn't. Oh, was he bad? He was. I just told her. What was up, though? What energy bar? Say that for myself. Cause it's really forget all these people. Should I go I think I'm gonna go outside? 
How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. I can tell that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. Yo, bro, that's oh, crazy, fuck. bro. I couldn't I think imagine. it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. That's a Can't reach that brick. Okay. Hey, man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Hey, man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Oh? That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. We just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. That place is full of TVs and electronics. Think you can do anything with bro, this? Bro, what's going on, no, bro? Like, what am I supposed to do? do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Where this nigga? Well, somewhere? fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? That got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Bro, how how did one remote get all them TVs to turn on? That's his brother. Oh Two yeah, that seconds is his searching him. We don't know if he has the keys. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. I can't reach that brick. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Damn. How'd you end up here? Well, I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time... On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. Bruh, I don't know what else to do, bruh, like... Do you think we're safe here? Well, I haven't been able to get through this gate so far. And the drugstore is safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took good care of it. It's well stocked and locks up well. Alright, go Let's back, inside. back inside. Okay.
How's your finger, Cleo? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad. What? All right. What what type of sense does it make? I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy. Okay. Okay. Same. You're my guy. Oh no, you know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Talk to Carly. All right. Hey, Carly. Are you ready? You ready to head out? What? That radio sign off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? Well, we can leave. I'm fine. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. Should I give her the bar? I don't know if I should give her the candy bar. I ain't gonna lie. Hey there. But that bitch said you ready to head out, so I'm on. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's Shit, go. Yeah. I ain't even know I could leave. So you mean to tell me? Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. That's kind of stupid. Imagine we save her and he don't even get none. He did just say noise attract him though. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Man, fuck it. Ow. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. I think I found a pretty damn good way to stop these guys quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Ha! 
loud though. Like I don't get it. The fuck? A pillow? Good luck smothering them to death. That's not really what I have in mind. We should keep looking around for weapons. Bro, do you even have a plan? You've been here the whole time, bro. Like, you're trying to save this girl. They really want to get into that room. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. What's a pillow gonna do to a zombie though, like? Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. The fuck? Wow. Wow. That was sick. should hold on to that. Could come in handy. Okay, if I move the car, that nigga gonna see us. But I'ma hit that nigga. Let me go back to the truck. Let me see the spark plug. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. That could scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. I W strats, W strats. Sneak up on that nigga. Oh! Uh, I ain't know they wanted me to do that. Stab that nigga in the head. Okay, now I'll let the car back. That was 
yourself. They like, oh, this nigga dumb. Stop playing with me, bro. Nigga, right in the forehead. Oh, that mug went straight through his head. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Where are these from? Two more. That should help. Why are you walking like this? Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Just like that, we're on the races. I thought they weren't gonna let me press it. I was gonna say. Oh my god. Rad. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Bro, leave this lady alone, bro. You might want to break through that board first. Bro, leave this lady alone, bro. I do not want to mess with this lady. I feel like she got bit or something. Out. Bro, I feel like she got bit, bro. Uh, look at her face. Oh God. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you. I said go away. A chunk, a whole I chunk on her side. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and she you come back <laughs> and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? Oh, imagine. We saved her and he ain't getting none. Glenn, oh, this I is don't want that. Friend. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please it's not go. Christian. Okay, uh, all right, we we'll leave. leave. Just yeah, tell me twice. Try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? What do you mean, borrow? Give yeah, it to where? Me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. That's not very Christian. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be not very one Christian. of them. They're, they're satanic. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me! We need to get going. Give it to me, please! This is crazy! Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up! Please! Oh, she on Tommy. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> I keep forgetting Lee got this messed up leg. Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. Oh, she really finna do it. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... No, no! no! Oh, my God. Yo. <laughs> I told you Glenn wasn't gonna get nothing. All in the end, he wasn't gonna get nothing, bro. Let's get out of here. In the end, I knew he wasn't gonna get nothing, bro. Come on now. Shit! 
Here they come! Get in! Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few canes of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. <laughs> How are we gonna do that? And I can't even go get the wish I'm gonna do. I can't even go outside. How you doing, Glenn? You know. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Back at the motor in. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. But that's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. I guess you really wanted that gun. Seems like. Why didn't you tell Carly to just give it to her? Would you have given it to her? No way. Then exactly. you know why. What's your next move? I don't know. I mean, you guys seem okay. What about your family? Yeah, I... I... Forget it, man. That's your business. Word. I hate feeling like I can't that do it. That ain't none of my business. I know the feeling, man. Try to get some rest. Huh. <laughs> yeah, right. right. Let me get this, this energy bar to my shooter. Here. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. Oh, nigga, I got an axe now. I can go outside. How we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. Yeah. Time to get into some action now, boy. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Careful. Get that brick, throw it at the I'm already I'm already tense to say it. Get that brick and throw it. Why is she sitting right there though? Like, why is she You open that wide, boy. It's the type of time and I'm on. It's the apocalypse. You live. Now's the time. That's my brother. Keep an eye Baby out. Baby brother. Where is this? Big brother. Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So. I mean, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. Shut up, nigga. I'm trying to have a heart to heart with my brother. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But knowing you were to take care of him tomorrow, that helped. Boy, there's something sad right here, boy. He gotta kill his brother. This on some. What's an anime reference I can use? 
Oh, he really. Yo, that nigga ain't dead. It's on some. Uh... Oh my gosh. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta do it one more time. I just. God. Dang, he got to There we go. His brother off. Holy crap! Run! Run, nigga, run! Let me tell me he's gonna sit there and look at him. I ran as soon as he said run. And then he got the dope. Oh dang. That was a bad, that was a bad tactic then. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get it. Dang, in. you're amazing. How long, huh? So these females, bro. Gotta hurry. Well, at least the block, uh, the back door ain't blocked, so shoot. She got stabbed in the back. Shoulder hurt just looking at that. I know that shit. Oh. Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. I that ah, door's not locked it. anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Glad we need you. Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. I should know what? Whoa. Huh? You said I should know. Shit! Damn, you should be honest with you. Are you sure? Oh, shit! What? Oh, shit! Okay, then. Clementine, can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing! Oh, wait! The window is screwed! Go! It's like a leash strong, ain't it? Oh! It's like a leash strong, man. Carly got good aim, boy. Get off, get off. Oh, my nigga, dude. Oh! oh, oh. Pick my shooter, bro. I have to. I gotta save my shooter. I gotta save my shooter. No, get him off of me. I'm kind of dumb, though, bro. Like, I wish I could. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Let's go. 
They got Doug. They... They... You gotta move! I hurt. I hurt. I hurt. Get up, Kamatar. Go ahead. You're not coming with this, you son of a bitch! No! Yo! What's up with him? Oh, this nigga racist. Oh my god, I I'm thought Kitty came somebody else Kenny. get eaten today. Especially a good friend. Bro, I thought Kenny was gonna kill me. My hand sweating from that. She just built like she got like a hard butt, like. <laughs> Chill out. Dang, bro. Oh. Somebody out there getting baked. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped <laughs> in that city. You did. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Yeah, he did, bro. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. But I'd rather make the wrong call and no than make the right call and not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Oh, yeah, he did, bro. You still think it, bro. Please, bro. Just go on. Just leave. We all got cars. Man. So weird. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man. Do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. That girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. W. Kenny, bro. Did Kenny been the only dude that had my back, bro. Kenny been the only dude that had my back, bro. Come over here, talk to the Kylie. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Dang. That's crazy. I'm sorry, Carl. That's crazy. It's okay. I'm with Doug Thanks, though. Adam would There's been die. a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. 
Because yeah. you had the gun. I, I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. But he over here talking to Clementine. Clementine almost lost her life twice. He looked bad. Oh, I swear, chunks. if it's a choice, you know I'm not picking him. He wasn't. Oh, so and then? Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. Where, bro? You, bro. Oh, sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Oh my Let me God, go deal with this. Oh man, Clementine, another thing. Bruh, are you sick? What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. God... And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you... You watch your ass. Wow. Hey, and that little girl. Lee? Well, rather, do you have a second? Do I have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. Oh. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Dang, the lights turned off. To be continued? What don't do me like it's a show? I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. Is that we new gotta trip? get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. Who I'm is? Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming. Worry me as much as the bandits. You No more, please. Lee, please. Oh. Ding. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Make sure you follow me on all socials. It's in the description down below. And let me know if y'all like this type of content. Because I'm really enjoying playing this game. For real, for real. But, yeah. Thank y'all for watching again. 
and I'm out.